Hello there guys, welcome to episode 4. Today we are playing Chelsea, who are currently sitting second in the league. Um, it's a massive game, we could go one point behind them with a win here. Um, got Izzy, is injured. Um, so Repka's going to have to come in here. Um, and we'll put Shemmel on the bench, I think. Um, Defoe is 93. I don't know whether to put Di Canio up front. Oh, it's a question, isn't it? Now I'm going to leave him, and I think I'm going to bring Di Canio on if that's the case. If he if Defoe gets a bit too tired, um, because this is our rivals, like technically our main rivals, I've got a feeling we're going to get beat here because that just seems to be the be the way the game goes. Um, <clears throat> I normally find that whenever I play my rivals, I normally get beat by them, whether it's home or away. Um, so we'll have to kind of see how this works out. But I mean, if if we do win, God, we we are looking really good for Europe. That's a good start by Bergstrom. He's been an amazing sign in this lad. I think I took on everyone's advice about using the scouts in Scandinavia, and he's done amazing. Um, but yeah, equaliser there, John Terry, gutting. But you always feel like we can get something from this game. Do you know what I mean? It's yeah, like we haven't lost. I've just realised we haven't lost a game this season. You know that that's madness. So I think that, I mean, I know there's a couple of teams, there's like four or five teams there that haven't lost as well, but it's still fantastic for us. We've got Mid Middlesbrough, such a tough team on this in this game. We go there next on the 13th. I, I don't know about Middlesbrough away. Um, that's what makes me think that we need to get something from this game. Perfect, Jermaine, fantastic. Um, because then we can sort of, <clears throat> if we go for a draw there, that'll be quality. 3-1, man, we are doing well. Oh, I thought he was going to get sent off there. Who's that Jasper Gronkiar? And to be fair, we haven't actually got our first team defenders as well. We've got Repka and Ian Pierce in the centre of defence. Because we've had to push um, Christian Daly to the defensive midfield role because Carrick's still out. Um, so we've got quite a bit of work to do. I'm going to bring a few people on here. I know that we're not playing until the 13th, but... Yeah, let's get. <clears throat> tell you what, yeah, let's put Def let's put Decanio in that position. He's knackered, this lad. Um, potential knee injury. Let me take him off. Um. Oh, okay, another one back for them. We don't want to concede here. Oh, I mean, it's heartbreaking. It's absolutely heartbreaking. Look at that, 82, 86. I mean, ugh, we're still unbeaten. I'm very pleased. I mean, that's good. <clears throat> I think it's always important that they recognise that. Um, I think it's going to be a few changes. David, I, do you know, I need to get rid of a few keepers. I just realised that Craig Forrest, he's just not going to play. His contract's up in um, in 2003. Lovely, people want him. Um, I, I put a few up for... Um, for transfers as well because I thought we need to sort of we've only got like 300 grand yeah this is good this is what we want so like McCann get him out the door no we're going for the most money Kitson get him out the door um Sunderland Kitson yep Leicester take him Forrest brilliant oh a little bit more. Let's push him for a little bit more. Stockport. I mean, I don't know how much money Stockport have got. Lovely. He's gone. That's good news. Kitson's gone. Brilliant. Lovely. That's another 600 grand in the bank. I might see if I can buy that defender now. Oh, God. I still only have... Um, where is he? I want my central defender position. Where is he? Uh, Hayden, that's the way I want. Hayden, sorry. Um, yeah, let's go 650 again. Oh, he's accepted the Newcastle offer. You see, that's what worried me. Oh, Shaka Hislop. Do I play Shaka? I do. <sighs> hmm. To be fair, his contract's off in 02. And that's quite a decent, that's quite a substantial bid. I think I am going to sell him. So I've got Bywater here as well, actually. He's not a bad keeper. I need to go off him a new contract, actually. Let me offer him a new contract, put him up. 
he'll be our third choice keeper David James will be the second choice I think yeah he's gone I'm surprised but it's money that we need we need we need this defender um, yeah so we've got 2.8 that's better it's looking good All right, bid him for this bloke can't believe Tommy Johnson's gone there gutted and we want this guy as well but I can wait for him Anderson 30 year old just looking around to see who the um, their top players are because they seem to produce some quite good ones um, nothing as yet right he's back that's good <coughs> Right, we need to look at this. So he's injured anyway. Um, let's get Repka off. Put him back on. Oh, hang on. Oh no, def goalkeeper. Shit, I was about to play him in goal. Um, defensive mid. Sub one. Sub two. Uh, Trevor Sinclair Lomas. I'm not going to give him new contracts. Are we happy with those positions? I think we are. Right, this is going to be a tricky game. Let's see how we get on here. <laughs> ah. Paul Ince Good player though Good defensive mid Captain as well oh, They've got a good team Middlesbrough I do actually quite like being them as well Get in I do actually like being them because You've got Paul Ince who's quality You've got Ugo Eki or Gareth Southgate Swartz are in goal. Boxic up front. They've got some quality players, you know. Alright, Carrick needs to be careful. <clears throat> right, who have we got after this? Ipswich. Um, yeah, they're near the bottom, but you could never, never be secure. Oh, Southgate's off. Here we go. Is there a glimmer here for us? What do you reckon? Yes, get in, Joe. I don't think he's going to be with us for long, Joe Cole. What a win, that is. What a win. That takes us to fourth. Oh, my days. This is good times right here. This is good times. Um, right, Ipswich and Leicester next game. And Derby, doable games. And then the Cup. Right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. That, that was a really another successful video. You know, we're still unbeaten in the league. We're doing fantastically well. Uh, please remember to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys later.